Hello everybody, my name is Zelenator and welcome back to Minecraft Across the 360. Here we are, TU-22. We're down here, doing stuff. I think we needed rails and then we got lost in a cave. And I remember cleaning up the water. Oh, there's more. Or cleaning up, using water to clean up the lava. Probably better way to put that. We're going to boop, 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 boop. One more. That's not the one more. There we go. Oop. Oh, I can jump that. Cool. All right, well, this is the last one, so spread. Increase your coverage. I don't know. Okay, anyway, I guess that was all that. Let's... Uh, doink. We'll block that off for now. I think we're done dealing with the water. I'm looking around, and there's not a lot going on here. Perky still doesn't want to go up. Boop! Did they change the browser look again? I don't know, not important. Okay, so while we are here, let's grab the redstone. We'll leave the iron for now. But let's grab the goods that are sitting right here. I want to say there's more redstone. Not too far as well. We're going to get... That's all iron. Is there not gold around here? blatantly obvious chunk border. I also did check the map, and I saw it on there. Oh, lapis! That's what it was. Oopsies, hold up. Swim! Still better than insta plus water. I'll take that, and that. Any lapis I dropped? I don't think so. Oh man, I need to eat. I can't eat in the water, though. Alright, swim! Because I'm pretty sure sprinting works. Wow in water. Okay, feast. Nom, 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 nom. I should turn this up on my end. Little too quiet. Okay, so uh, let's head back into the caves. Yeah, I don't know where I am. We're gonna head back into the caves and see if we can find more. We What we really want is another mine shaft. I need more rails and I want them for free. Howdy, Paul. Welcome back to the stream. Mm. Her goes to villager since 1.6. Is that over there? But I feel like that's part of the cave I was already at. Let me make a mental map of that. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's a little farther than I thought. Unless this goes down, this might. Nope, I don't think so. Interesting. That was not where we we already passed. Oh, wait, hold on. This is probably it. I was going to say, I'm pretty sure we just passed where the water is. Yeah, this is it. Oh, there's redstone. In fact, there's also redstone on the other side. Man, we have more goods to collect. I really don't need all this lapis. What am I picking it up? I like lapis. I should build something out of it. Ah, they changed the texture. I forgot. We have the 1.6 texture. The beta 1.2 texture is my favorite version of Lapis, the Lapis block. I was sad when they changed it to 1.6. I don't know why they did that. Someone at Mojang didn't like the Lapis texture and said, let's change it. Let's make it a grid pattern. It, it doesn't... <laughs> I didn't want it to be like a big tile on the floor or the wall. I wanted it to be a continuous surface. Oh well. Maybe they changed it and added the border A to get away from Notch. No, this is 2013. Notch was still there. Notch didn't sell his share until 2014. Um, so never mind. Scratch that. But maybe they added the border to be consistent with the other stuff. Because Redstone Blocks had a border. Kinda. Um... Iron, gold, diamond, those blocks have borders. Emerald, lapis was the only ore block to not have a border pattern on it. Where it's, you have the block face and then lines going around the sides. So maybe that's why they did it, to be consistent with the other block types. Wait, does the coal ore have a border? Which was added in the same update. 
the block of coal was added officially, ignore the, the April Fools 2013, the block of coal was added in 1.6, which was the same update that changed the lapis texture. I don't know, but I will say I kind of like the the black redstone texture that was in the April Fools update. Looky here, I wish I had water. I hope I find a mine shaft. I probably won't. Unless I get back to the one I was exploring before. That would be nice, but I I'm not feeling too confident in this. So let's dig around. There's some lapis. Did this lapis really replace my diamonds? I would not be surprised. Is there more diamond down here? I don't know. Let's keep digging around. We'll be smart about this. I'd rather not dig and find some lava. So we gotta be smart. Be prepared to react. It was just one diamond. I bet it wasn't supposed to be a, a single diamond, but the lapis and or lava replaced the diamond ore spawning location. Oh well. I'll, I, I just have to deal with it. Alright, uh, boop. So we'll let that work its magic. That lava's going to take a little bit to go away. Not as bad as before. Praise be a notch for that one, but we'll need to, there's, there's a fair amount of it. So I'm going to wait over here, pick up this redstone, and since this tunnel ended rather quickly, we'll be heading back that way. How are we doing on redstone? Almost two stacks. Cool, I almost have enough to make another Another redstone contraption, one that doesn't involve sticky pistons, since I need a lot more slime balls. Ah, oh, that's already a chunk border. Whoop. Where are we? We're still at the edge of the beta chunks. Okay, nope, not that. Okay. Uh, what was that? That's a ceiling, right? Yeah, the cave ends. Oh well, we're gonna be smart. I don't know if this drops down. So let's get all the goods. I do not plan on going west. There's there's no cave that goes west right now. And also, I'd rather not load up whoop load up any more new chunks. I haven't checked the world, but recently all these all this caving expedition way over here. You see all that jungle on the map? That's just a small bit of it. There's a lot more, a lot more chunks that aren't available on the map, and they won't be until I finish fully exploring. Yeah, I want to head back to that most recent mineshaft, the big one. That's what they call Patrick. And I don't remember exactly where it is. Oh, is there more? The end is never the end. Junk border, never mind. Junk borders are great at causing... Is that... Yeah, that is. If not, it's about to be. Yeah, junk borders are great at causing the end. Right, let's get the pickaxe out from our hotbar slot. I don't want to accidentally throw it down at a terrible time and it ends up burning in lava or something. Something catastrophic like that. If the, Honestly, if I were to accidentally throw the pickaxe in lava on one of these mining trips, and there's still so much left of it, I would probably load last save. Exit. Do not save. Hey, mineshaft. Is this the mineshaft I want? Uh, maybe. I don't know. I'm looking for the large mine shaft since we've encountered a few on here. I think three or four. Two of them, for sure, have been really small. One of them is quite sizable. That's the one I'm looking for. I wonder if that is this one.
There are more chunks loaded than what is on the map. The map obviously shows all the chunks that are loaded. But far at the edges, there are chunks. Hello! Aw, oh, man. There we go. But far at the edges, there are more chunks that have not been loaded. Or that have been loaded. That was one of the 30 second ones. We're just gonna sit here. Because this is probably gonna get us to half a heart. Maybe. Maybe I'll get lucky and it'll bring us down to like two. Nah, half a heart. That's how it usually is. So now we sit here and we wait. And heal. I would rather not go walking out into another dark cave with only two hearts. That'd be a terrible idea. So while we get our health on the up and up, we can get rid of this. Do 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 do. Get rid of that. Do 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 do. I'll wait another half a heart and then start walking. All right. I don't want to wait here forever. That's kind of boring. If this was my own time, if I wasn't streaming, yes, I would wait longer. But since we're not, let's just go, go, go. Is this another chunk border? Yep. They're everywhere around here. This is what happens when you're... when you go caving in this area. I saw the darkness and I had to go for it. Bye! I have one more pickaxe. That's fine. I saw the dark cave and I had to go exploring. But thinking about it now, where's the mine shaft? Oops! Hello! Zombo villager. Got a skelly ball. Bye bye. Spider! I want to get that out of my hotbar though. Come on down, buddy. Thank you. Should have let him take the fall damage, then swing my sword. There's a cooldown for when mobs are able to take damage. Same thing with the player. I just see something strange. I guess not. I don't know. Look back at the live preview. Everything seemed fine. Hello. What is this dark open space I'm looking into? Uh, yeah. I don't know. Not much is going on around here. Oh boy, we're already coming upon the the chunk border again. This time, the 1.2 chunks. So far, still haven't entered them. Unless the cave is the same. I was talking about this before. If the caves between 1.1 and 1.2 are the same, then I really just might potentially end up wandering all the way to the top left of the map. I don't want to do that. But it, it might be possible. I don't know how much caves changed. So my urge to explore... Like, oh, another one? Uh oh! Heh <laughs> heh. Creeper got her. And we're down to our last stack of torches. I was almost thinking about trying to find the mine shaft for real, for real. And trying to pick up some of the planks. Then I'd make a crafting table. And. What else? I'd make a crafting table. What's up, Bat? How's it going? I'm Batman. Make a crafting table, and there's snow. Make a pickaxe, and go from there. But that's not gonna happen anymore. Because we are not close to that mine shaft. And I'm missing four hearts. It would be wise if we heal up. So that snow, I think we're getting close to autosave. Uh oh. Wait, hold on. Uh oh, that skelly bomb's gonna go pew 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 when I when the uh, autosave finishes. Has it really been 15 minutes already? I was at Minecon, Minecon 2016. Uh, 
fight. Ah, leave me alone. I need to get the skelly bottle. Be they became more annoying because of their rapid fire when you're too close. Okay. It's a ravine. That's what we're walking into right here. We'll explore the ravine a little later because it has surface access. I don't need that just yet. <clears throat> At the rate we're going, uh, I might be able to free up a slot with my helmet breaking. But at the rate we're going, we are definitely getting mighty close towards the uh, edge of the chunks there because the snow, the snow bomb doesn't go much farther. Click. Who was that? Another skelly bum. Yeah, targets eliminated. All right, let's keep focusing more on the caves around here. But this is definitely coming to be the end of the line in regards to caves to explore on this side. Then we're going to cross the ravine. The good thing about having this surface access ravine is it'll point us. I know how to very easily get back here. Because it's not easy, oop, it's not easy to miss this entire ravine poking out of the ground. Oh, it's a little underground uh, pond. I don't know what these are called. Springs, maybe? Underground springs. I should call them underground summers. <laughs> People are going to question, what does that mean? It's like, well, it's not spring, it's summer. It doesn't even make sense. I'm not gonna remember that after the day, be prepared. People are gonna ask me on stream five years from now because they just finished watching and they, they leave a comment on Pi Day, March 14th, 2029. Anyone watching this on March 14th, 2029, leave a comment saying, hey, it's been five years. Underground Summers. Yeah, say something like that. I don't know how many people are going to watch this on March 14th, 2029. Uh oh! We're coming upon the end of our torches. That was fun while it lasted. I don't get to have any pie today. We don't have pie. Yeah, if I made a crafting table, I'd also combine these redstone and lapis stacks. So that's another my fault. Okay, so let's see. There's another blatantly obvious chunk border right there. Uh, you think there's a cave that gets us out of here in this particular area? Ah, oh, there's more creepers, really? Look, terror from above. The end is never the end for the reign of the creepers. Nom 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 nom. We're going out into the darkness a little bit. How low are we? We're at 55. We're only about 10 blocks below sea level. Those are nine. I think the chunk border here is causing us to not be able to advance because the way it curves off there Okay, so we'll head back to the ravine, and that is where we'll find our exit. So then we'll just hope oh, I my leg come back to this area again later, if I remember. Oh, is it becoming daytime? That'd be nice. Okay, so we have our ravine. My leg. We have our ravine. How do we use it? Oi, baby zombies on the move. Do, do, do. I'm only able to efficiently get out of here because all these, all this surface access right here, is very effective at getting me to where I want to be. 
Okay, so it looks like... This looks like a ravine that was cut off. Caverns do not open this wide. So we're going to use this water here. Yeah, let's block it off. Boop. We're going to use that water there. And let's go. This is going to get us most of the way up. I'll be very mad if a skelly bomb pops up from one of these holes. Oh, that's so much faster. Oh, wait, hold up. Uh, boop. Come on. There we go. So, let's see. We made it up here. Now where? Is this a chunk border right here? Very well might be. 56 to 57? I think that is. So maybe caves did change in 1.2. The generation itself is mostly the same. Oh, how convenient. Would you look at that? What do we have here? We have some vines. They almost... They can almost reach us. Um, so let's see how to take advantage of these. We could wait around a few more minutes just to let the vines grow. Or I could just start going now. So that one, I'm gonna fill that in. Here we go. Oh, oopsies, almost, hold up. Can I, am I not able to place that block there? That's a problem. Okay, um, sorry vines, I'm gonna have to get rid of you temporarily. There we go. Oh no, now I can't make it up. My leg. I don't think bone meal on vines works. Last time I remember, vines are not bone mealable. Are these floating? Or are these connected on this side? Uh, oh wait, hold on. We might be able to... Here, if we take advantage of that, let's start filling this in just a little bit more. Gives us more solid blocks for the vines to grow on. I don't know if my shears right. If I had my shears. All right, hold on. What is this? What is this one piece of gravel doing? I don't want it. Uh, boop. I freed up an inventory slot. Did it grow yet? Nope, not yet. Still missing two. What I should have done, I should have done the bottom one only. Oh, here, this is grown. Hooray, let's go. Oh no, we're so close. We're right here. That's close enough. Cool. Alright, so. Well, I'm right here. You know what I need to do now? We need to collect. We might as well collect. Uh, logs. Brown. Uh, collect the jungle trees. I have all this dirt on me. Boy. Oh, is this the ravine I came out of? It is. Yeah, we're gonna use up some of this dirt. This will free up another slot. And make this hole less demeaning. I don't think I used that word right. Okay, so there's another slot free. These can combine and be put away. Alright, cool. So now I can chop down a couple jungle trees. Oh, wait. This is oak wood, isn't it? Nope, this is jungle. I didn't remember if these stubby bushes when they generated if they generated as oak or as jungle wait are these jungle or are these oak leaves why do they use jungle wood but oak leaves i don't know by the way i need the logs and we also need to find a proper jungle tree there's one we need the we need the jungle saplings so we're just going to break that and that. All right, here we go. Give me the goods, please. So now we sit here and we wait as we collect a few jungle saplings, probably four, so that way I can grow a big jungle tree. <sighs> 
Something of this terrain was bound to happen sooner or later. Yeah, we're going straight that way once we're done. You know, while we wait around for that to grow, how about... Uh, is there any water around here? Oh, there is! I was going to say, in fact, do I even need to build a pillar? Probably not. I'll build a short one. I'll build a short pillar. I just need to remember it's basically at the edge of the chunk border. Oopsies. This is a really cool area. Unfortunately, I won't get to enjoy it for the time being. Okay, that's good enough. But yeah, my leg. I didn't realize I was missing so much health and hunger. Let's let's eat all the bread. That'll heal us up quite a bit. Any more jungle saplings? Can you stop taking fall damage? Oi, tennis Steve, what are you doing? All right, there's one sapling. That's a start. Come on. Give me more, por favor. Getting the map nice and updated, just in case anything else happens to happen. I don't want to come back here. If I really get one sapling from that whole jungle tree, we're not going to have a good time. Because I don't know if I'll get more than one sapling, oopsies, more than one sapling next time out of this one jungle tree that will be growing when we get home. Unless there's a jungle tree waiting right around here. I don't want to go that way. Oh, there's an- in fact here, there's another one right there, I think. That one. Whoop! That's the hole I crawled out of. The deep dark pit. Chills. Nah, I don't want to go that way. I guess I'll take my chances with the one jungle tree. One jungle tree, even if we don't get any additional saplings out of it, will still be enough logs. In fact, with the 16 logs I have now, that's already a lot of cocoa beans I can grow. We'll be working on that cocoa bean farm when we get back. Okay, I think it's just those last three leaf blocks. We'll leave them. We don't need them. Alright, and away we go. Hard drive turned on for some reason. I hear it. Y'all might even be able to hear it as well. Let's see, where's that bridge? There it is. If I really wanted, I could add an ice path on one side of the bridge. If I had Soap Touch. Since this is not a cold biome anymore. But if I had Soak Touch, I would be able to make a extension of this bridge that has... Wow, it doesn't even show up on the map, because it's only three blocks wide. Uh, I could make an extension of the bridge that has ice on it, and that way I could take the speed boost properties of ice, use that to my advantage. Make it a... Ceiling only two blocks tall, cover the ice and trap doors. I would zoom down there if I spammed sprint and jump. Of course, that would just totally demolish my hunger because of all the sprinting and all the jumping. But it would be worth it. Go, go, go. So, I think what we'll do, we'll make some more rails. I don't know how long it'll be until we're back at the mineshaft finding more rails again. So I'll just accept what we have. And call it a day. Oh wait, I have the minecart. Right, yes I do. We can go zooming. Kind of. Auto save. Wait, I'm not there. Okay. Close enough. Close enough, I suppose. Do, 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 do. Pretty soon here, I'll need to look into the... Uh, whatchamacallit. I'll need to look into the patch notes again. 
We're gonna start getting some of the 1.7 changes. I don't know when, but it should be coming up soon. We start getting some of the 1.7 stuff a little early, then we get the 1.7 bombs with the rest of the 1.8 features. Do I still have dirt? Yes, I do, because I see there's another block that's missing, I think. Oh, maybe not. Maybe I'm just seeing things. Oh well, how about we fill this in? Make it a little flatter. There we go. Oh, this is the block that was missing. I don't think. Definitely. Enderman has been here. You know, I still need to keep digging out that pit. One of these days I will. That day might be today if I have enough motivation to do, to do so. We're going to organize all our stuff, and then we'll work on that cocoa bean farm. That was it. I almost said cocoa melon farm. <laughs> nope. That is not the case. Uh, we have a lot of items. Oi. So, this jungle sapling, we're going to replant. I usually don't do this, but this is, this is a special matter. I, yeah, I normally do not replant saplings because there's no need. I don't need the stuff that badly. I don't need that many trees. We have plenty of trees. Except we don't have plenty of jungle trees. So I'll plant it. Where would I want a jungle tree? There's not a really good place for one. If I were to make it on my house, that might be cool. Plant it right smack dab in the middle. You think this will look good? I don't know. We'll see. If it doesn't look good, I'll just chop it down. That's plenty of light, right? I don't know. If I sleep, then it'll be even less of a problem. All that path. Or all, yeah, all that just for one diamond. But hey, we're doing better with lapis and redstone now. That's a lot of redstone blocks. I just now realized we can make a lot of good stuff with that. Oh yeah, and the lapis as well. We can make a lot of goods. Oi. Away with the dirt. Green inventory is a happy inventory. That looks just a little bit better. Oh yeah, and this bow. I don't need it. Man, I have all these partially damaged bows. I kind of like it when the bows used to drop the non-damaged bows. Uh oh well. Maybe I should start working on getting that chicken farm going soon. Oi! We have farms to do. One thing at a time. We're going to start out with the cocoa bean farm. Oh yeah, we need torches. That's, uh, that's the first step. That's the real first step. Here, let's make a whole bunch of planks. We're gonna go all out on the planks now. That way I don't need to make all these in the planks later. Oops. Now let's make a bunch of sticks. Not all the planks, so. Close enough. All right, uh, ba -doop, ba -doop. And this is why I still held on to some of the stacks of coal to make the torches, as opposed to turning them into blocks. You can't make torches out of blocks. Out of coal blocks, I should say. That would be kind of cool if you had a super effective torch. Like, say you combine a plank with a coal block. It, it'd be a really beefy torch, and then that really beefy torch would have a much farther light radius. Oh, my helmet's gone. There we go. Freed up another slot. Okay, let's put, a, let's put the rails away for now. Oh, yeah, I wonder if they fixed the animal breeding yet. Let's go find out. 
See y'all later. So I need, in fact, here. We need to pass by the wheat farm first. Because we need to collect the wheat for, for the sheep. Because I want another sheep. A few versions ago, it was telling me, hey, animals can't enter love mode. You've already hit the the cap for that. And I think to myself, no, no, no. I don't know what you're talking about. This is fine. If I get the same problem again, I don't know what to do. I'm going to have to start going around getting rid of all the stragglers. So that way it'll free up the mob cap again. Man, it's so limiting, though. I wish you could set mob caps for specific stuff. Because I would max out the sheep and minimize it for the other stuff. No, I'd max out the cows. Because I need leather. That's why I started the cow farm. Yeah, I want at least three sheep. There we go. Now it's not telling me the animals can't enter love mode anymore. Cool. I don't know how long until the mob cap. I was right. Y'all remember when I said... Uh, that the dark gray plus white will give us a light gray sheep. Look at that, we got a light gray sheep. I was right. Okay, now that all that's taken care of, we'll need to head back to the farm. Back to the farm area. And start figuring out where I want to put the... Put down the jungle logs. We'll see how many cocoa beans we have currently. But now, with the cocoa farm going, we'll have plenty. Okay, hold up. Let's, let's zoom straight to the farm. We. I wonder if I left stuff in the furnaces. I don't remember. Alright, how many? 11. 11 cocoa beans. That's a start. Uh, maybe we'll... Do something up here. We still have more to this cave. Oop, I can't sprint. We still have a little more here in the cave. Do I want to put the cocoa beans way off in this area? I guess I could. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. Eh, that'll be fine. I guess that's what we'll do. It's getting really cramped in here, oi. Oh, wait. Uh, that's not going to work. I need it to be spread out this much. Because if I don't, there won't be enough space to put the cocoa beans in between. Because there will only be one spot for each of them. I needed the two block gap because I needed one for there and one for there. There we go. Boop. Ta-da. I think that torch can move. Put it there. Alright, there we go. That one's already grown up fast. Cool. I really don't need too many cocoa, cocoa farms. I'm not going to be making massive amounts of cookies. I could if I wanted. We Once we get a chicken farm going, then we'll be able to get a lot of eggs from that. I think it's egg to make cookies, right? One egg and two cocoa beans. Okay, we're gonna set that one there and set that one there. And then this last dirt's going to fill the hole. That's about, oopsies. It's gonna fill the hole that old pier once I clean up the stone in the floor. I do not want that stone in the floor. I wanna keep it grass. Oh, I was about to say, do, do Cocoa Pods not have, not have collision? That's not true, they do. That one grew up fast. I wonder why they made Cocoa Beans grow up so quickly. It's faster than Sugarcane, and Sugarcane already grows pretty quickly. Oh well, not too important. So yeah, now that we have the Sugarcane going, let's go pick up some of that wheat. 
let's pick up the wheat and then see if we can make more cows now that the sheep are done having the fun the sweet's not just gonna be for the animals though it's gonna be for me I've been eating bread for quite a while now. There have not been enough animals around to sustain my hunger. Alright, there we go. We got stacking that. Oh, of course, this gives us so many. This gives us so many seeds that I don't know what to do with. We're not going to get the 1.14 composter, so it's just going to take up space, or I use them for chicken breeding. But I don't need to use seeds for chicken breeding when I could spawn more eggs but that's that's for future me we'll go from there all right and boop there we go yeah that's a lot of seeds that we're dealing with you know what I haven't done I haven't done a sugarcane farm not a sugarcane sorry a cactus farm yeah, we're gonna need to figure out a new spot. I cannot fit another... I cannot fit another farm in there. I could make it right there. Right in front of that stuff. But this is a walkway. I don't want to have cactus right where a walkway is. Maybe I'll build it right here. Have it be like a floating platform. That could be interesting. In fact, not the cobblestone. Why don't I do that? So, I'll extend it off of here. How many blocks? I need... I'll, I'll be going for a minimalistic design. So let's start out with... Three blocks up. So that one's going to be there. That's one corner. Oopsies. In fact, I... Never mind. I, I, I need to keep that. I need to keep that because... Uh, sand... Does not float. So this is basically going to be two blocks thick for most of it because I need to set the sand in something. So it's going to be sand for there. So block, sand, block. We'll probably just do a basic four by four. So that'll be 16 cacti in total. It's not cactuses. All right, boop. Does this seem like a good size? Probably. It, it really does not need to be super large. There we go. Okay. So, one, two. That's cactus three. Border. Cactus four. Border. In fact, while we're here, let's also dig up the stone. Oh, thank you, Torch. I was able to pick you up. Okay, so little badoop. One, two, three, four, and now we take the two corners and then just have them meet. I can't see that corner. Oh, kind of. Was that it? Yep. Cool. If I really wanted, I could use glass. I could use glass for the cross sections. That might look a little strange because in doing so, that means the sand or there will be solid blocks only beneath the sand. And I don't know how good that's going to look. I'll, I'll need dirt. I'll need to fill this in. Bring that up. I guess I could collect the dirt from down here. Since this isn't going to be helping anyone anymore. Diggy, diggy, dirt. Auto save. I'm ready. Says SpongeBob. Do 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 do. There we go. 
I think the autosave is faster again. There was a time where it felt slow in saving the world. I think they optimized it and now it saves faster again. I remember talking about that on a recent episode, I think. How it slowed down. And now it feels better. So with all this like this, now that we have our main area, yeah, let's start working on filling in the second block. We're also going to add a couple support pillars. This one side is held up by the hill, but not the rest of it. And can I Halo Reach? Yes, I can. There we go. So then this will be... I may only need the one support pillar because this corner, this corner is pretty much held up by that chunk of land. Do think I can reach that? Oh, I can, cool. Uh, boop. Okay, we should have enough cobblestone to fill this in. Two stacks should be plenty. That one was not where it was supposed to be. Kind of want to put a torch up here. This is going to get dark. There we go. If I took the time, I would like to put more torches around the ceiling. But I don't feel like taking the time just yet. Maybe later, when I apply some more finishing touches to this underground village. This has been more utility rather than decoration. The farm is here. Nine out of ten furnaces. Stuff like that. Oh well. It'll be both. It'll be utility and decoration. Having the underground village. It'll also serve as one of the first things I worked on. Oops. That one doesn't go there, and neither does that. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Drop torch right smack dab in the middle. And now we can fill all this in. Oopsies. Uh, you know what? No, that belongs there. That was all my dirt. Ah, but I need another eight more, eight more blocks. How's it looking down here? This area's kind of dark. Boop. I'm probably going to bring this down as well. This does not need to be unnecessarily high up. Okay, now how, how are we feeling? Ah, let's take that out as well. We hit our dirt quota, but y'all know me. No, let's bring that down. It'll look smoother. There we go. Now I may even be able to fill this in. But let's take care of the top parts first. One thing at a time, one thing at a time. There we go. Yay, so now I just need 16, 16 sand and a cactus. The cactus I'll pick up now. We only have 15, that's fine, this is a start. Now this is cool, then I could put something else back there, but that'll be for later. We'll need to wait around a little bit for the dirt of this area to start turning into grass. I'll take that, thank you. There we go. Save the cobblestone. Even though I really should be doing it the other way around. Spend the cobble, save the dirt, because I have far more cobblestone than dirt right now. But let's... Oh, is it nighttime? 
yeah, let's pass by the cobblestone storage area, drop off what we have, then we'll head home, pick up the sand, make a return, plant the cactus, and the cactus farm will be done. We did I test before if an iron shovel does enough damage? It does not. The pickaxe does. The pickaxe and the axe do enough damage to the minecart to break it in one hit. I don't think it's worth using multiple hits. Hey guys, how's it going? Sand. That's what we need. 16 sand. Uh, let's just... But, oop. That's so much easier. Well, too late. While we're here, how about we catch some Z's? Turn it today. That was some weird camera stuff going on right there. I'm back up to level 40. Okay, if I make it to level... 55. If we get up to level 55, we'll do enchanting again. Hello, son. How's it going? Oh, the jungle tree grew up. Ew, it's ugly. Oh, man, it's yellow. It's right in the desert. I forgot my house is in a desert. Well, at least it's not gonna rain at my house. I will take that. I don't know what's worse. Desert grass or swamp grass? Even if you dislike them equally, you got... You need to at least appreciate that it doesn't rain in a desert. So that's something. Alright, cactus. Which one of you is going to grow up first so that way I can plant the last block? Hmm. Hmm. Any volunteers? Anyone? Nope. Okay, so we have... Let's go work on other stuff then. I don't know how long... It shouldn't be too long until we get one more cactus we will do. Plant it. Okay, so let's see. How's this all doing? Are we really down to 23... 23 bread? Honestly, I could start eating melon. Ooh, the cocoa beans are growing. If I started eating some of the watermelon here, then that's that's something. Okay, how many cocoa beans do I need? Oops, I only need one more. Okay, let's just break all of these for now. Is there a tool to break cocoa beans? I don't know. But yeah, this stuff grows up very fast. That's why I'm fine with such a small farm. It'll grow up quickly. Boop. Alright, cool. 19 profit to begin with. That's a good start. Yeah, we should also pick up the sugar cane. You know what? I just realized if I really wanted, I could make a bunch of pumpkin pies. Because, think about it, we have all these pumpkins. We have a big old pumpkin farm. We have all the sugarcane. It's a big old sugarcane farm. The only thing we need is eggs. I haven't yet made my egg farm. But, that'll be super effective as well. So this is going to be great. So, I was going to put the chicken farm over there. But I'm kind of wondering... Maybe I should put it around this area instead. I don't know. Probably not. I'll keep the chickens with the other animals. I'll keep them close by. That way all the animals are together. It's going to need its own storage system anyway. You may or may not believe just how many eggs a small scale chicken farm produces. Oh wait, hold up. Stop the train. You may or may not believe just how many eggs a small-scale chicken farm produces over a long time. Spoiler alert, it's a lot of eggs. You hit the point where you don't know what to do with the eggs anymore. So you could just keep expanding the chests, make more and more and more of them. 
but that's that's how it is. I think these are all clear. I really just need to check the four corners in the center. Then I won't need to check the other four. In fact, I could probably just check the four corners of the furnace. I don't even think I need to check the center. When would I put stuff in the middle of the furnace, but nowhere else? Because if I was really lazy and mad dashing it. What am I doing? Let's take the fast way. And the fun way. I'm very glad they brought back the camera turn. That was a Java feature that was removed in 1.6. It was removed on here as well in 1.6. And then they brought it back. But we still have to deal with this pathetic looking arm swing animation. Uh, oh, I didn't like gold in there. I'll take it. So what do I want to do with that tree? That birch tree, not the birch, the jungle. Do I want to chop it down? I'm thinking about it. If I chop it down, I could see just how many uh, saplings we get back from it. Let's go. If I don't get any saplings back from this, it's not meant to be. Oh man, I cannot hail a reach up there. Last one. Place your bets now. Think we'll get zero saplings? Think we'll get one sapling? Or do you think we'll get more than one sapling? We'll check back in a couple minutes. So now we can almost start doing stuff with jungle wood. But what we need to do first is make some rails. Is this it? We do not have a lot of rails to work with. Let me grab all this iron. We're gonna need to make pickaxes first. Oh boy. We have 41 iron that I can spend. Okay. Next time we go mining, we are definitely picking up iron. Yeah, we need sticks. I'm in luck. We have plenty of sticks. Let's make four pickaxes. I think that was four. Yeah. So that'll resupply this whole little corner of my inventory. So with that taken care of, now we can make rails. How much iron left do we have to make rails? Close enough, that leaves us with five iron bars left over. Let me just check, see, do we not have any food? We really don't. Okay, so we'll take the rails and we'll take the powered rails and the torches. Then we're gonna work more on the track Let's check back on our our uh, tree. So it looks like we have one sapling so far. Think any more fell? Eh, it was a small tree. Yeah, it's only, what, two blocks? So you have the stump, you grew out two blocks, plus an extra block to catch it. We have one more block after that. It probably did not drop any saplings off the edge. So I guess we're back to uh, one sapling. Yeah, we have so much of that loaded up now. So much of the jungle. We don't need this much jungle on this small of a world. We're gonna be missing. We have such a small chance for whatever the new biomes are in 1.7. Oh wait. Come on. Come on, Leaf. Go away. There's a very small chance that it's going to drop something. But a small chance is not absolute zero. Come on, drop a sapling. Drop a sapling, I believe in you. It's always the last leaf block, every time. It's always the last leaf block that takes the longest. Oh, it's gone. Cool. Thank you. How are we doing on sun? It'll be nighttime soon. Maybe I should make some of that wheat now. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll, all, we'll head all the way back to the farm. We'll make some more bread with the wheat. Then we'll come back here. And that will be that. Do, 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 do. Auto save. Wait, hold on. I'm in a minecart. Almost. Almost made it towards the end. But this is the fourth one, right? Yeah, we're almost at an hour. It's an hour streaming. 
All right, I'm not gonna break it. There's no need. My leg. I wouldn't be eating so much bread if I wasn't taking so much fall damage. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna grab seeds. Why are we grabbing seeds? We are having an absolute zero chance that we will take up our hotbar slot because there will be no hotbar for them to fill up. If I really wanted to solve my wheat problem, I could just go AFK. Have some AFK times on here. Dig a little hidey hole or something. Oh, well, the, uh, the thingies grew up. Okay, so we're going to grab one stack and three. That's 32, right? Nope, that says 33. A stack and a half will give us half a stack of bread. All right, so... Uh, nope. Oops. There we go. I don't know what all this cactus is going to be used for, but I'll have it. Let's head home, shall we? If I truthfully wasn't sprinting around so much, I would not be consuming so much bread either. So this is my lifestyle, but oh well. The game can't tell me how not to play. I choose to play my way. No one can tell you what you can or cannot do. Minecraft release 1.0 official trailer. Is it night time yet? Do, 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 do. Come on, turn it to 6. 6 p.m. that is. The start of the Minecraft day is... It should be tick 0, which is 6 a.m. Oh wait, oh, wrong way. Then half a day, 12,000 ticks, is, um, uh, 6 p.m. sunset, I think. Something like that. There's another egg. Slowly but surely, we are filling up. You think I could place the rails while in the minecart? Maybe it'll let me do that if I just hold left click. How about we try it? Let's find out. And... No. <laughs> yeah, that's a big nope. I don't know if that's because I started poorly or what, but there's no point going all the way back. Ah, oh, it only works if I walking okay let's let's use the little boost though let's boost i received a text one day group chat <laughs> it was a picture and the caption was let's boost and it was a typo it was supposed to say let's boogie it was funny though let's boost <laughs> random inside joke Okay, that was fun while it lasted. Okay, is this it? Is this really as far as we can go? Pathetic. Not really. This is this is truthfully gotten us rather far away from home. So this is a very big... In fact, this is going to save me so much food. Oh, no. What is this? What is this? Did I really not line this up? Whatever. That means the torch has to move. I was complaining about that yesterday. Or the day before, I don't remember. Uh, the, I'll figure out how to organize it later. So now I need... Uh, we're going to move that map over. Now the, uh, the speed gain from that one extra block is not going to be enough. We. You think this works? Oh no, because you can't... I forgot, you... Yeah, <laughs> this isn't the old minecarts. I'm so used to the old minecart boosting trick. Bo minecart boosting trick. And of course, I... Minecarts work very differently now. I don't get to enjoy old minecart bugs. 
Oui. And uh, zoop. Slap. Okay, let's try this from the very beginning. See how far for it. What is this? Enderman. Why? Okay, where did this come from? I don't know. It could be anywhere around here. Might not even be from around here. There's gonna be a random hole somewhere. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where the Enderman took that from, so I'll deal with it. Okay, this will this will get us all the way down. We Okay. Who thinks we'll be able to make it all the way to the other side of the bridge? I don't think so. I think we're going to slow down completely halfway across this first one I'm talking about. Oh, we're slowing. Well, I was partially right. We slowed down most of the way. We almost made it, though. That was super effective. Oops. So, I really only need the powered rails somewhere around the middle. That's when that's when I felt the big slowdown. I think it was a little before the shadow. So, I guess we'll go around here. This is right about where we started slowing down. Oop. Alright, time to try again. See how far this this gets us. Whee! We're not gonna make it. Yeah, uh, doink. You know, while we're here, since I'm pretty sure we're not gonna get much more of a boost, let's replace these three. This will be this will be a starting point because that's right about where we feel the slowdown. So I won't add any more going up here just yet. But we shall see how far this takes us. I'm pretty sure only three powered rails gets us to maximum velocity. So I don't need to put more than three down at a time. Of course, that's also Java edition rules. This is this is console. For all I know, it only takes two. One is definitely not enough. I remember doing some testing before. Oop, I felt that. Felt that slowdown? I did. So that was right about here. So I'll put it right before we go up the first hill. I think that hill was the where it made it really noticeable. So now we will try this out. This one, this is really, it's not as far as it needs to be. Absolutely, we still have to cross this monstrosity. But the minecart where it stands now is pretty good. We, because if I just go down the hill, boom, we hit those powered rails, and we'll see. We'll see if we're able to make it up the hill where the staircase is. I don't think so, but we're going to try it. Because now that we have these powered rails right here, yeah, okay. Uh, I'll put it here. This is a start. This is not going to get us all the way. Isn't this fun? Going back and forth on a minecarts. I'm having a great time, especially because of how fast these minecarts go. Zoop. That was fun. So I'm not going to put down the last three rails just yet, because I think we might have one more. One more minecart booster track that needs to be plopped down. So testing from this far back should be good enough. And especially since we have this big slope right here. We, the one we just went down. That one definitely brings us up to max speed. I finished mining a while ago. Oh, we almost made it. 
that last hill, the last part of the hill, right here. We almost made it up all the way. So I'll put one more torch right here, and then this will be... That'll get us up all the way. Alright, cool. So I was right. We did need one more set. Yeah, right now we're just working on... Oh, my arm broke. Right now we're just working on... Popping down rails. Oh, wait, hold on. Stop the train. Don't go down. Don't go down. Don't go down. Hold. Good job. There are a couple of eggs on the floor. How about we pick those up? I'm not sure when I'll get to enjoy my num-nums. I'm starting to feel hungry, though. But I know I have another 45 minutes... I shall wait. Alright, boop. Zoom, zoom. Away we go. I think we're gonna make it pretty far. In fact, we should be zooming by the time we uh, uh, approach, get, a, get to the starting point of the bridge. Sun's starting to go down. Whoop. Yeah! So now I need to go mining a lot. Oops. One, two, three. But at least now we've made it this far. Still have 23 powered rails. That'll. That should be good enough. Alright, zoop. Oh no! You didn't let me in. Why didn't you let me in? Probably server lag. Whenever something doesn't work, blame server lag. Because that's probably why. The game didn't internally register your change fast enough. We. So yeah, what we'll be doing next is going back down to the mines. And picking up all that iron. Since we have a lot of iron in those new chunks that we haven't acquired yet. Zoop! Zoop! Oh, I saw that slowdown. And then it gave us the boost. So we'll be dropping off our extra supplies. Then we're going to head home. Well, we're going to head to the mine after dropping off the supplies. There we go. That chest is still there. I forgot. Hold on. Didn't I leave bread in there? I think I did. Let's see if there's anything else useful. Not a lot. I kind of want to keep the... Keep the starter chest. Just because. But there's a... I think there's bread in here. Yeah, I'll take the bread. Cool. I'll leave everything else. I don't really need the apples. Not yet, at least. I don't know if I'll ever make golden apples. I don't usually enter such dangerous areas where I feel the need to nom nom on a notch apple. What are we doing on eggs? 16 plus 11. It's 27. That's a good start. Oh yeah, I was also supposed to make more bread in general with all this wheat I've been carrying around. 54. Uh, you know what, while we're here, let's grab... Let's grab another stack of sticks. And since we won't be mining coal, we're going to be focused on iron. Let's grab that. Iron is going to be our big priority this time. A mine shaft would count as a bonus, free rails, but we're going to be focusing on iron. Because not only for the rails, but also for the beacon. Are you ready to test this out? What, why did that... I don't know. Must have touched a button. So we're gonna take this... Oh wait, hold on, what am I doing? We're going to take the minecart. In fact, I almost want to construct an express cart. Okay, let's, let's get the main track done first. So, what I'm talking about with the express cart is I would leave my home. It would be it would start up there on the mountain and it would go across the mountain range and it would approach this area. Like it would connect right here. And so from the minecart, I would go zooming. And it basically means that when I leave from my house, I would go all the way here. 
or if I leave directly from my house, I'd go straight there. I don't need to pass by the... Whoa! Sort of lag. I wouldn't need to pass by the middleman minecart thing. At the rate we're going, I might as well just have every minecart leave from my house. Okay, let's see. Oh, I see that pillar over there. I guess that cobblestone pillar is a good guide marker for where I want to go. That's where we're headed. Unless I want to mine right there. There's that tiny cave. That... Not... No, it, it would not. It definitely would not lead into the beta 1.8 cave. Because... There's a totally different terrain generator. There would be a junk border. Oh, do I already get the iron? Interesting. Oh. Let's, let's put the sand somewhere else. There we go. A nice way to get out. So that was fun while it lasted, but let's head. Let's head this way, I suppose. Yeah, I slept, so we're not going to need to worry about nighttime for a little bit. Oh, wait, hold on. How about we go down here? Why check out somewhere that I know exists when I can check out something that I don't know? Oh, there's light down there. Oh, there's a torch. Of course it connects. You know, I'm not surprised. Yeah, let's get this iron. I still have the pickaxe, right? Yeah, just making sure. Just making sure that fortune pickaxe is still with me. Just in case I run into some diamonds or redstone or something like that. There's going to be a staircase that I'm probably never going to use again. But at least now I know what's at the top of this. Since I probably looked up it, saw the darkness, and figured I'll just come back later. Well, now it's later. I'm back. Oop. Is that that? Yep. Let's get all this iron that I've left behind, since this whole portion of the cave around here is not, or all the iron was left behind, because by this point, as you can see, by this point my inventory was pretty much full, and I wasn't even going for iron. Let's drop that torch, let's also block off that water, I was going to keep it around, you does something to land in, but I don't need to do that anymore. So if I stick to where the torches are, I should find plenty of iron. And then I could go find the area that doesn't have torches. But if we're this far this way, I should probably start working on going back. I should backtrack a little. Get to the the older caves compared to the new ones. It's still absurd to me to think that the cave system, the entire cave system, from all the way over there, way off in that corner, basically the edge of the map, straight ahead. The caves all the way from there, leading off in this direction, it's all connected. We've traveled, where are we? Pretty much 400 blocks. Almost 400 blocks in one direction. And it's all cave connections. That's a little, that's a little absurd to me. Some more iron. This looks like a cave in. Oops. Okay. Let's take a look see. Do, 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 do. 
let's get all the iron. I wonder how much of this series has been me mining. Hello, person, popping up an hour and 20 minutes into this stream or into this video. If you're currently watching, either A, you got very lucky and you just skipped around, found this part, or B, you take the time to watch all of these. So here's a question. I've done so much mining on this series so far, and it's not anything special. This isn't a modded series. We're not finding much that's interesting. So I'm going to ask y'all, I'm going to ask the person that's watching this at this moment, because there's a high probability that you watch all my streams or at least listen to. I've got no problem if you're not watching, watching. It's fine if you just listen. So question for you right now. Uh, would y'all be fine if I did a lot of, lot more mining off camera? All the, uh, all the jokes aside, I've done so much mining because of how much iron I need for my projects between the beacon and the rails. So, would y'all be cool if I did a lot less mining? We got one no from Paul. We got one no from Paul right now. But yeah, I'll be I'll be waiting a few days or so. I don't know how long it takes on average for people to get to the stream. Out of 896 question mark subscribers, I only get about 20 views after a few days or so. So we'll see. Yes, yeah, start leaving your comments in the Comment box below. I'll post the description. You do not leave comments in the description. So yeah, that's all that. So I figured, you know, instead of continually mining, 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 what if I did all the mining on my own time? So we'll see. We'll see. I'll wait around for y'all to decide. If you're watching this five years in the future on still watching this on March 14th, 2029, sorry, your vote doesn't matter. You're a little late. That's just, that's just how it is. Okay, I want to get back to that area since I think I've hit the part of the caves where I have already mined all the iron. So now I want to get back to some of the newer parts where I have not been mining the iron since I was focused on trying to find mine shafts. I know it's this direction, but that only gets me so far when caves limit <laughs> which way you go. Oops, that's a button. Mining and cave exploration is good. I have fun. I enjoy it. But if it's taking up 40% of my stream time, that's kind of repetitive. I don't know if it's really 40%. I haven't done proper math. But it feels like most of the series has been me down in a cave. I guess I'm fulfilling the mine part of Minecraft. <laughs> But I don't know. Okay, we're gonna heal up. Oh look, Lapis. And that's why I keep, I've keep i decided to start keeping this fortune pickaxe on me. And also because I think I found redstone or diamond that one time. And I didn't have the pickaxe. Then I've been carrying it ever since then. Yeah, so I don't know how to get back to where I was, so... Oop, more lap, or redstone. Yeah, red ore, red ore, not blue ore. Oh, but wait, there's more. There is more red ore. It continues. Why did I leave all this? Was my inventory full? when I was here? I don't know. Okay, there's that iron there. I think we shall leave it. I need a lot of iron, but I don't need iron that badly. If it was diamond, I would get it. In fact, even if it was gold, I would get it. Gold is... 
I need for more powered rails. Because I don't think what we have is going to last us. Let's put that torch there real temporarily. Let all that drop. There we go. I don't think I need to put real there. Oh well, too late. Oh wait, is this not a cave? Oh, it is! Hello there. And by building this little pathway, I'm making a mental connection. Oopsies. And also by... Oh no, it fell! And this will also make a visual connection for when I'm in this area again. Up we go. I'll even take another... Another way back into the surface. What is this dirt block doing there? Was that an Enderman? I wouldn't be surprised if an Enderman was walking around on the surface. Uh, well, it was dirt. It wasn't grass. Endermen usually don't pick up dirt. They pick up grass instead. And the reason is because they're walking around on the surface where there's grass. Dirt's not on the surface. Uh, generally. Not unless it was a cliff or something and the intermittent happened to pick it up but the odds of that start getting a little low so I'm going to say it was not an enderman but I'll never know for sure one of those minecraft unsolved mysteries it's not even a minecraft mystery it's just a mystery of this world how did that get there for all I know the dirt really did generate there or I'm totally blanking from one of my streams and I accidentally placed it down. That could be another thing. It could have been me. And I didn't remember. Alright, there's lava that way. So we won't get rid of it just yet because it doesn't take 10 minutes to go away anymore. So we'll focus on all the iron here. Okay, so... Uh, dirt on me, I do not. I guess it'll take up another slot. That's fine for now. Anything crawling out of there? Not yet. Not yet is intentional. There's probably something bad lurking, lurking in there. Something that wants to attack. I just can't see it. Unless it's nighttime and the mob cap filled up real quickly. Hello! There it is! There was a zombie. That's what wanted to attack. And dead end. That was fun while it lasted. Yeah, we are right about back at the middle of the snowy area. We want to get to the edge. So I'll find... I'll be accepting of any exit. I'll be accepting of any exit point. That's also kind of dark. Let's... Uh, that's fine. I think it's going to be auto-saving soon. A couple more minutes or so. So, we are here. We're heading back south. Back towards the beta chunk border. Oop. That might be the chunk border right there. So, we are almost to where I want to be. Since I have at least two areas that head up to the surface right alongside the beta chunk border so I'm in the general vicinity of where I want to be just not quite there oh I remember all this cobblestone oh look mine shaft I don't remember if this is the mine shaft I think it's one of the small ones that would be good for me because if it's a small one I think it is I have a pathway directly out of here. Oh wait, it's going over the ravine. Never mind, this might be the big shaft. I don't think the small ones went over any ravines, which means I could be finding some rails in here. I didn't carve up all of them last time I was in the area. Good for me. Oh man, I don't where I did that. Yeah, this is the big mine shaft. Hooray! Auto save, I was right. Oh, there's a spotter. Aha! We found rails. Cool. It's kind of funny. I went looking for rails, found more cave. 
I went, and now I'm going for going caving. I found more rails. Well, I have plenty of inventory space now, and I will gladly take all these free rails. Thank you, ancient builders. Is that it? Nine? Is that all? I know I got rid of a lot of them, but I didn't think I got rid of that many. I don't know. Aha! Here's more. Cool. Uh, we'll go this way first before turning around. Okay, but probably not rails that direction. We're gonna fill this in real quickly here. I would rather not accidentally fall. That That is a fall I probably would not survive. I don't want to test. There's no need for that. Let's pick up all that. And all of that. I think all of that was an old Nickelodeon show. I don't think I watched it. What are we at? We're at 30. Well, that's an improvement. I'll gladly take 30 rails over 9. Yes, Paul, that is indeed a dirt room. The one that kind of got cut in half by the cave here. What it feels like. How far? Oh, nope, never mind. I didn't need to jump that. I think we're back at the edge of it. Where are we now? We got a chunk border here. Well, I think we probably got all the rails. If not, I don't think there are too many rails left. So if we start heading towards an exit, then I think this would be a good place to be done with our whole little journey over here since we got back to the mine shaft that I know, or I guess I knew it had uh, rails in. So let's head this way, shall we? I don't know if this is getting us to where we want to be. We're right next to the chunk border, though. So I know we are almost to where I want to be. Oh, wait, if I keep going this way... Okay, that's not a staircase. That's not a staircase. I know I have. I have two different staircases. One right next to the chunk border and one very close to the chunk border. At two different points. I don't need to make a third one. Well, I could just take my chances and start wandering in this direction and hope that we end up Somewhere else, we'll find an exit eventually. You ready for another episode of Zelenator Gets Lost in the Cave? I'm not entirely lost. I just haven't committed to memory exactly where they are. Aha! Here it is. Ooh, it's nighttime. So it looks like this is the one that's right up against the chunk border. Oh wait, that's not night, that's dirt. Teehee. Here we go. Hey, it's daytime. I'll take it, because that means I get to skimmy skimmy on over. Oh, flashbacks. I remember this area. Oh, nighttime's approaching, though. Oh, look, there's that chest of cobblestone. Should I get it now? If I don't get it now, I might forget about it again. I left treasure for me. Cool. Oh, wait, sun's coming up, not going down. Yeah, even better. We still need to skimmy skimmy this way and head back to where we were. We were toward the beginning of the episode.
when we found the ravine and stuff like that. I wonder if more of those vines have grown up by now. Let's head down and check. All right, come on. Use up the last hunger. Okay, while we are right here, I kind of want to chop down one of these jungle trees. But no, not yet. Where's the pillar? Hold up. Well, I guess I loaded the chunks I didn't want to. Too late. Oi, I will not enter, though. I will not enter the jungle. I'll take advantage of whatever, whatever trees populated the chunks at the border. Okay, so those vines have grown up. Oh, wait. I don't think I'll need to. Here, let's put down these torches now. Get this area nice and bright if ever I pop up here at night. Okay, so, with this area safer, OSHA would be slightly happier. <laughs> this world is definitely not OSHA compliant. Oh well. So, we're gonna try to do something magical. We're gonna try to land in that water right there. Think we'll make it? Yeah! Cool. Oopsies, I didn't mean both of those. There we go. Hooray, now we can, uh-oh. Really, buddy? You know, I'll keep the water like that. It's fine. Let's light up down here to help prevent further stuff from... Uh, stuff like that from happening again. Now we're in a great area to find. Uh, iron. That's the word I was looking for. Now here's that ravine. So we're back here. Enderman. Hey buddy. Get mad at me. I'm ready to fight. Yeah! I got the pearl. Cool. Now I think we're at five. Or four. I don't remember. I'm still trying to get up to 12. I don't know how we're going to solve our end portal problem, but I'll, I'll think of something when I feel like it. Uh oh. Ah, oh, man. She got me. That wasn't supposed to happen. Okay, now I gotta quickly take out Mr. Zomble, because I'm not going to get to heal up. I'll have to deal with going down to some low health here. That's a problem. Oh, that was a short one? Yeah. One thing about Splash Potions is it's more effective the closer you are to the radius, to the inside, where it officially splashed down. So because I was towards the edge of the potion radius, it wasn't the full thing. This is what I want. I didn't want to get splashed at all, but I'll take it. It's a lot better than a direct hit. Hello. We're getting surrounded. Yeah. Oh, wait. Was that a bat? I thought I saw something else. I guess it was just a bat. Okay. I'll take it. Hooray. Filled up another, another stack of iron. The chunk border. Yep, chunk burger. This cave would probably be so much more expansive if that beta chunk border wasn't there. If I'm encountering so many access points to the chunk border, that means a lot of the cave has been cut off. Hello, I see you. Oop. 
And just like that, we're down to our last stack of torches. Like, it's fine, it's fine. Now that I'm taking care of all these caves, when I come back here... When I come back, we're going straight to the ravine. But when I come back here, we'll be going... We'll be all nice and prepared. We'll be all set up for... Taking the iron in new caves, since I think the older caves have been cleaned out now. The ones where I was looking for the mine shaft, I think those are all good now. We're gonna hope. Hey, creeper. How's it going? Nope. Ow! <laughs> he didn't. He didn't press the button. That is the most annoying thing in the world when I the the camera perspective changes at the worst possible time. I hear a zombie. Okay, we're gonna go for that iron. Absolutely, that one has no danger other than falling. No fall protection, not OSHA for compliant. So, we need, do, 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 ba -doop. Now let's get out of here. Take that, thank you. There's that zombie I was hearing. I hope. <laughs> well, a quiet day. Seems like people have already moved on from the series <laughs> and uh, at only 24 episodes we're a third of the way done uh, that's not true we're only slightly more than a quarter 24 out of 80 episodes oh well we'll see if people make a return later whoop i haven't been looking at the tube stats all that much so i don't know where is he nah there we go. He's phasing through the wall a little bit. Anyways, I haven't looked at the tube stats, so I don't know how well the videos are going over there. But yeah, there's noticeably more people showing up on stream earlier. Earlier in the series. That's kind of how it is. Nearly every YouTube or otherwise series you do. It's usually the most popular at the very beginning and the very end. Okay, let's see. So, how to... I think I'm looking at water right there. I'm seeing something. Uh, we'll take this staircase. Oh, man, it's dirt. Oh, well. I could always use more dirt. Creeper holes never cease to pop up. That was right. I see that water now. Jump, jump. Big jump. Is that, uh, gold? Hooray! I'll take it, since pretty soon here we're going to run out of powered rails, so I need to start getting gold now to resupply. Is this another chalk border? Where am I? Oh, we're even farther! Oh no! I'm going to have so few 1.7 chunks, it'll be a little sad. It's going to be very sad when we update to 1.8, we get the last of the, we get the 1.7 biomes. There's not gonna be much. There's gonna be barely any. 
Oh well. Alright, so... Oopsies, did I just run part of my staircase? That's fine, there are other methods. Oh look, look at all this redstone. Cool. So let's... Uh... Oh, oh, oh. uh doop. Uh oh. That was our last torch. That's fine, that's fine. Okay, let's... do this as I want so now this will this will be efficient for making the porches oopsies yeah I realize that it's fine there we go the good thing about torches is at least I use them Yeah, I've traveled so far. I've traveled so very far in this cave system. I was surprised at how far the cave extended originally. This is... this is intense. This is so much more. This is so much more than I thought it would. You know, if I really want... I have the... Are we going back? Yeah. If I really wanted, I have this chest. I could make some of Zelenator's buried treasure. Chunk border. How are we doing on gold? We should have... Yeah, we only have six. That's not all that much. Uh, we have plenty of lapis, right? Oh, in fact, I haven't been mining that redstone with the fortune pickaxe. Oopsies. It was kind of my fault. Oh boy, 62 normal lapis. Howdy, Enrique Dem. Welcome back to the stream. Is my inventory full of cobblestone? No, plenty of stack left. Oh, we got 42. That's what they all say. Maybe gone, but not forgotten. Where's the... Where's the exit? Hold up. How did I get down here? Did I really walk across? Oh. My fault. Did I really get rid of all that water? I kind of wish I didn't. I don't know if I blocked it off or if I deleted it. I deleted it. Man, I I needed that. Oh well. So let's see. We are figuring out where the map went. Okay, we are right at the edge here. We need to go somewhere else. This area has served its purpose. I think we're close to the ravine. This is that very steep drop that provided no diamonds, but it did give us some more redstone. Yeah, did I come this way? I don't know. <laughs> Let's find out. Aha! This looks like more to explore. We have 42, so I can keep mining iron for now. Oops. Double oops. Nah, that was intentional. Let's see. So we need to find... We need to find more iron now that we're back here. At least it's dark, so now I know where to 
better place to torch is. Let's go up here, shall we? I think there's another part. Redstone platform bitrate. I'm slightly confused about what redstone platform you're talking about. You talking about the tube? Because honestly, I haven't, I haven't tried streaming. Okay, uh, that's what I was thinking, but at first you said redstone platform, and I was thinking to myself, well, I haven't done a lot of redstone on here. But I don't know. I don't plan on going back mid-series. I gotta be consistent. So we're not going to try again until this series is over. And we go back to InfDev Plus. So we'll find out later. And yeah, now that we're back here, time to keep finding the... Keep trying to find where to go next. I think we want to go this way. We must advance all the way to the corner, since I don't think this is the ravine I want to be in. Oh, hello. Sneaky iron. Oh wait, I don't know if it was sneaky iron. I think my pickaxe broke here. I think that's what happened. You know, I don't remember. Not important. Okay, let's block that off. And block that off. Drop a torch. There we go. So I don't know if this is officially a ravine. It feels like a ravine that was that was cut off by a biome and not cut off by chunks. So let's take care of this backside. And we'll go from there. My leg! I can say that since soybeans should be feeling better now. He seemed to find in his most recent video. Well, at least the more we explore, the more torches we place. The more torches we place, the more inventory we'll have free. Oop. I was about to put a piece of redstone there. That was going to be not fun. There was an old bug that I never really re remember, or I never even did much. You were able to um, duplicate, not duplicate, you were able to make a obsidian farm. You were able to make an obsidian generator using lava and redstone. I don't remember how you did it. I never did it on any of my own worlds. But it was, it was a strange bug, and I was really confused at the time. I was a small fry when I first found out about it, so I was like, I don't know what this is. And then, it wasn't until years later that I started seeing other people in old videos make reference to that. And I was like, interesting. I don't know when it got fixed, probably sometime in release. But I'm pretty sure, at least in the early release and older you were able to make an obsidian farm with redstone there's something with the lava would replace the redstone and then it was the uh that lava the flowing lava would turn into dust this cave is all connected not dust the flowing lava would turn into the obsidian this cave is connected! No! We are going farther and farther into the jungle. Okay, this is not what I wanted. I guess this kind of proves, if I'm looking at this right... Whoa, it's another ravine! This kind of proves, I think, that the cave generation did not change. So because the cave just continued on and on... We get to enjoy that. So we're not going to touch that. We need to back away from the jungle. I wouldn't be surprised if I checked the map and there's only three or four chunks left that haven't been generated. I'll be really sad, but that's... Reality is sad sometimes. Flashbacks to the tweet 
I res the C418 tweet I responded to just earlier. Oopsies. There we go. Now I can get the redstone out of my hotbar. There we go. A clean hotbar is a happy hotbar. Clean inventory is a happy inventory. I wonder if that's on the berg yet. I think I've said it enough times that I should go in there. Well, we passed another stack of iron. I'll take it. Unless I passed a stack of iron shortly, a uh, short amount of time ago. And what happened was I wasn't picking up the iron. I haven't been paying attention, so if I was missing that iron because I've been mining it and I never picked it up since my inventory was full, oops. But I don't know. Okay, so yeah, right now, yeah, we are right at. I, 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 there's more cave. The urge, the urge to keep going, but I shouldn't, because if I do, that'll just lead to more. Or I should say that'll lead to less, less 1.7 biomes. I wonder how many people, how many people loaded up so much of their world that they didn't get any of the new 1.7 biomes back in the console days, PS3 and um, 360. We're going slightly over today. Ow, who did that? We're going slightly over today because I started slightly late. Oop, oop, I need a feast. Nom 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 nom. Oop. Yeah, I can understand a lot of kids being very disappointed with the 1.8 update and be like, all these new biomes, cool. Realizing, oh no, I ooh, I came out of the darkness. And then they realized that their whole world was already loaded up, so they won't get to enjoy any of it. Nope! Ah, he went boom. That's not cool. It's a civil crime for a creeper to explode in this world. Of course, I can't really punish him. What does he get? The death penalty? Hello! Don't do it! Wow, that was the first time I fought a witch on here before she threw a splash potion. Cool. So, the stream says 157.53. We're gonna go a little longer. We still haven't hit that last autosave. Once we hit that last autosave, the 8th one, I think. Unless it's 7. Hello. Uh, yeah. Nope. Ow, that was knockback. Yeah, whenever we hit the next autosave, that's when it's time to start wrapping it up. That one, pick up the dirt. Good job. Tell him. Uh, who am I again? Tennis Steve. I forgot. I forgot which skin I selected. I wonder if we get any more default skins. Like, it's alright having six or seven different versions of Steve. But I, I kind of would like some more. And since we can't log in, we can't sign in with the Microsoft account or anything. This is all the Steves that... Whatever Steves we get to enjoy are whatever Steves that we are given. Oh man, that cave goes that way. I want to explore. Oi. This is right where I want to be. But I know I shouldn't. Oh wait, now I'm on this side of the ravine. Cool. Let's see, you think the skelly bomb's still there? Oh, there's the, uh, there's the, uh, whatchamacallit, XP from the creeper. Oh, wait, no, that wasn't from the creeper. That's from the, uh, the coal. The creeper blew up the coal, and since ores, non smuthable ores drop XP. non smuthable ores drop XP when you mine them. That's why the... That's where the thing came from. Yeah, now that we hit our last autosave, and our inventory is absolutely full, 
We're gonna grab this chest here. We're gonna have some super secret zelenator loot. Boop. We're gonna fill this up with cobblestone. All the cobblestone. Since I kind of have additional additional stacks on me. So it was I got my fault for picking it up. But yeah, say your farewells now, y'all. We'll be back again later. Where is that skelly bomb? Oh, he's up there. The skelly bomb didn't go away. He was waiting for me. But yeah, we'll we'll figure that out tomorrow. Uh, we have some more mining to do. Keep working more in the minecart track. Tomorrow's got to be an early day stream since it's Friday. And yeah, thank you all for watching. Bye.